Welcome to another Skydemon tutorial video. Today we're going to cover Skydemon's NOTAM functionality. Your NOTAM briefing is one of the most important parts of safely planning your flight. To see the NOTAM briefing for your planned flight, slide out the purple NOTAM tab on the right hand side of the screen. This briefing is live. It updates itself as you make changes to your route and as new NOTAM are published by authorities. Simply scroll through the list, reading each one, and then you can make a decision regarding whether any NOTAMs present a hazard to your flight. Many NOTAMs will have a pair of binoculars, which you can touch, and the NOTAM location or area will be shown on the main map. The NOTAM briefing is divided into as many as four parts. The first part is for your takeoff aerodrome. The next part are warnings, followed by en route NOTAM, and finally, the NOTAMs for your landing aerodrome. Sometimes you may decide that a particular NOTAM is of no relevance to your flight, or indeed any flight you're likely to undertake. In this case, you can hide the NOTAM so it will no longer be displayed. To hide a NOTAM from your briefing, use your finger to slide it to the right. If we do this with two NOTAMs, or more, you can see that they've been replaced with a little note, saying that there are more NOTAMs off to the right. You can touch this note to reveal the hidden NOTAMs. And if you want to, you can slide them back to the left to unhide them. Some NOTAMs cannot be hidden because they relate to an airspace restriction or something else very important. One of the most powerful features in Skydemon is our graphical NOTAM depiction. Not all NOTAMs can be graphically depicted, but many can, and graphical NOTAMs can give you a quick idea about what hazardous situations might exist across the country when you're preparing for a day of flying. Let's have a look at some of the types of NOTAMs you're likely to see on the map. NOTAMs telling you that an obstruction has been erected are shown with this symbol, which is a purple double obstruction symbol. Purple is used throughout Skydemon when referring to NOTAMs. NOTAMs about restrictions to flight or dangerous aerial activity are shown with an orange border and a purple hatched background. As with all things on the map, you can open the What's Here menu to read more about the NOTAM, including its effective dates and its full text. Some NOTAMs apply to existing pieces of airspace. If you see a danger area grow a thick orange outline, that indicates a NOTAM has additionally activated it or otherwise changed its hours of operation. If you see it grow a thick green outline, that indicates a NOTAM has deactivated it. In either case, you'll want to open the What's Here menu to read exactly what the NOTAM is doing to that airspace. NOTAMs with a hatched purple background and a grey edge signify a warning about some sort of unusual aerial activity taking place. These are typically not as important as the warnings about restrictions or military exercises, which have an orange outline, but they're still very important. Finally, you may notice little purple crosses on the map these usually refer to obstacles whose lighting is currently unserviceable, and therefore they will usually be coincident with an obstruction symbol on the map. The NOTAM briefing I showed you earlier was a narrow route brief, which is the most commonly used. However, it's also possible to switch to an area brief, which is useful when you don't know exactly where you'll be flying, but you'll be staying within a certain distance of your airfield. Open the NOTAM briefing, touch the Tools menu, and select Area Brief. You'll need to select a center for the brief, which is usually the airfield you'll be taking off from. We will choose Sywell. Once you've done this, you'll see the area highlighted on the map in yellow. And your NOTAM briefing will include all the en route and warning NOTAMs inside that area. Skydemon offers you the best NOTAM functionality of any app on the market. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Why not plan a few routes and explore the map to see if you can find the many different types of NOTAM I've talked about.